Hey guys, this is CG Animator, and today I'm going to show you how to load plugins in Blender. So before I get started, please comment and rate this video, subscribe to my page if you like my stuff, add me as a friend if you need a friend, and check out my other tutorials. Okay, so let's get started. So the first thing you need to know is that there are texture and sequence plugins. Uh, sequence plugins being for the sequence editor. So you can get these from two links. They're in the description box. Go ahead and read it and you can find it and go to those pages. There's a lot of really good ones that I really recommend and that can make it a lot easier on you. And um, I'm using Blender 2.49, uh, the second version. It's really good. It works really smooth. And there's a bunch of nice changes. And um, that's pretty much it. So I'm going to show you how to load the texture ones now. So just go over here to the materials tab. Go here to texture, and then instead of texture type none, go to plugin, and then just load the plugin. So make sure you d download the DLL file. It's really simple. So I'm just gonna go to my plugins right here. DLL is water and terrain is for texture, and obviously green screen and Robocop is for the sequence editor. So I'll just show you water. I'm not gonna show you how to use them, just how to load them, and as you can see right here it's a new plugin and you can mess around with a bunch of stuff and uh, I'm not going to get into it uh, very much but that there's a pretty cool texture okay so I'm just gonna put this back to none so now I'm going to show you the sequence editor so go over here and change from model to sequence press space and add a scene okay and just drag it to the very back okay now you have to have the scene selected when you load a plugin or else it won't work. So just right click it and then press space, plugin, and just go to where you were before and find the, the plugin. Let me make this a little bit bigger. Okay. Plugins. So I'm just going to show you Robocop. And just put it right here above it. Let me bring this back down. So now, if you can see here, there's these lines here that give it the feeling of an old TV, like when Robocop was made. And you can change all these settings right here, I think. Yeah, this is it. And right here on the effect, you can change the thickness of the line, as you can see, and the color. And everything works differently. But they're pretty much, uh, well, I can't say that they're the same in terms of like effects, how you change them, but they're not hard to understand. You can definitely get it, and that's pretty much it. I just, you know, thought I should show it since there's not too many. I haven't found a tutorial on how to load plugins or where to find them, so I figured I might as well. And that's it. So please comment and rate this video, subscribe to my page, add me as a friend, and check out my other tutorials. And if you have any questions or problems, just message me. And if you have any requests for any tutorials, just message, message me or leave me a comment. Okay, thanks.